Welcome along to Toborona Stables where we're here with latest exhibition and the Paul Nolan team obviously fresh from victory at the Cheltenham Festival but we're looking forward to Fairy House and the Boyle Sport sponsored Irish National Meeting and latest exhibition he doesn't have monkfish to take on this time he's a lot of rivals to take on uh, in the Irish National what an absolute cracker we have in store and the Nolan runners got to be respected after the performance of Miss Milner at Cheltenham let's see what Paul has to say latest exhibition is interesting the season he's had because he was a good bit further behind Monkfish at the Dublin Race Festival than he was at Christmas. Yeah, I just don't think it was the same horse. I think that, you know, for whatever reason, he just, he, he was a better horse at Christmas and uh, maybe that the, the Christmas race took a bit more out of him than we thought. Tough race. Uh, tough race uh, and, and, and uh, you know, our fella, he's not a big, robust sort of, but he's an angular type of horse and I, 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 I'm hoping to God that he's in a better place now and uh, I think that the, the longer the gap between his races the better he'll be and, uh, um, and possibly my horses were, I'm not saying that you know that, that uh, there was nothing much wrong with them but I th they think they could be sort of a little bit better now maybe than when they were then, they just seem to be coming out of whatever little bit of a cloud, we could find nothing wrong, bloods, lung washes, everything seemed okay but for whatever reason we were disappointed with a few of them and and maybe he'll be a little bit better as well, I hope. Also for Fairy House, you can go for the Underwriting Exchange Gold Cup or you can go for the Boyle Sports Irish National. They're two totally different races. You're going to make a decision late, I think. Yeah, I mean, you know, ideally the novice race is the race probably for the horse's sake to run in to a degree, but, you know, I, I think he's more comfortable over three miles. Uh, he's not a horse that's going to win a race impressively, I think, at any stage. I mean, he, you know, he went to, to, to Leopardstown then and I'd say that was a tough race. If they get a very wet week before Fairy House and it comes up heavy, I don't know whether I'd like to be running over three and a half miles either in the National. You know, so those will be decisions we'll have to make. If Envoy Allen turns up in the, two, in the novice race, that could sway us as well, you know what I mean? So we're going to try and run in the race that we think we have the best chance of winning. You know, so that's basically what we're going to try and do, and and uh, and hopefully, hopefully, we'll make the right decision. Obviously, the source, like the, the colours, are quite um, special to you as well, and Jim Mern, and it's a great connections in the, in terms of yeah. the horse. You know, Jim Jim bred the horse, and Jim then sold the horse, and uh, three other guys there: John Brennan, uh, Dan Brown, and 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 and, and Jim Coffey got involved in him and kept him in the yard and uh, you know so I mean it's 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 thanks be to God that those guys done that and and, and, and it's it's great to, to, to have men like that to have confidence in you to invest in you and the first race he ran in for those colours then he won the grade one in Leopardstown and we got off on a great foot. So you know we're hoping to God that the horse stays in one piece and, and wins more prize money for them. Come on now, be, be honest with us, which way are you edging towards, grade one or handicap? Yeah, well there's no doubt that, that that's going to be a big decision, but, and, 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 and it certainly won't be just on me. You know, we'll sit down and we'll sit down with the owners. The safest option is the, is the, is the novice race. You know, the, the Grand National would be the dream job that if we made the right decision and it ended up being the right decision, you know, it's great then, but it's, it's a tough decision to make, but it's great to be able to ha have the horse, to have a decision like it to make. 